Hi, I'm Bob Rubart with the Oracle Technology Network, and the evidence suggests that this is another two-minute tech tip. Delivering today's tip is Francesco Amores Torres, a solution architect and enterprise performance management integration specialist with Infratex. How are you, Francisco? Really good. Well, tell me about the topic of your tech tip. What will you be talking about today? Today, we'll be introducing the migration of mappings from FDM Classic to FDME. If you are ready, your two minutes starts now. Okay, welcome everyone. Yeah, you know that in FDME we have a lot of new functionality and one of that is the FDME -E mappings. Uh, today we'll try to get you the key factors for migrating your FDM Classic mappings into the new ones. One of the new features is the multidimensional mappings that you were missing in FDM Classic. You remember about using the var values in your mapping scripts, not performing really well, and then you were just getting um, really low performance on your import process. With the multidimensional mappings, you can use source dimensions, lookup dimensions to create your multidimensional mappings through the user interface. Really useful. Another good thing is that now we have a new mapping script type. In FDM Classic, you remember about VBScript, not so uh, performing well, executing for every line, using the var values array. Nowadays, we have Jython script, which is a replacement of the BB script, but the, new, uh, the good news are that SQL mapping script is available now. That will let you have a really, really good improvement in your scripts because it is just running one update statement for all rows matching the mapping criteria. So when you migrate 30 your seconds. Mapping, when you migrate your mapping scripts, first go through the SQL. If the mapping logic is so complex, then go to the Jython scripting. Also remember about using the new API, FDN row, FDN result, FDN result map. You will be able to map more than one dimension in the same script. Ten seconds. So take your time, review your mapping logic go through the new functionality, play with the multidimensional mappings. First, SQL, then Jython. Enjoy. Go. All right. Cool. <laughs> Thanks for a great tip. Let's do this again sometime. Whenever you want, I'm here for you.